Hey everybody, I am working on a little project and it's on just a little piece of glass from a picture frame. And I really liked this color combination, if you can see it. It's red, white, and copper. And I thought I would do a big one. And this is a 20 by 20 gallery wrapped canvas. So that's what I'll be working on today. And I have my colors here. There is copper, and it is from Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics, and then the red, and that is crimson red from the Fine Touch. I don't have my jar, so but that's what it is. And then my white is in the bottle. I actually have two bottles of it, uh, and that is Artist Loft Flow Acrylic. So I'm going to go ahead and get started, and I'm going to be doing two flip cups today and I will be adding a little bit of three-in-one silicone in between uh, colors. So go ahead and start and get my gloves on real quick. As usual, I'm just going to go ahead and pour a little bit of white. In for the close-up. Try not to give you have too much glare there. But these colors blended really cool. And there's quite a few cells. And there is some lacing also. That pink right there is like a really bright pink. It looks really cool. And then there's some cells right there. There's also some lacing um, scattered a little bit throughout so I really like that like right there I don't know if you can see it too good but right there's a bunch of lacing and right up through there but I really like that pink it's really bright anyway this turned out pretty cool I'm really happy with it so 
Hey everybody, I just wanted to show you this painting all dry. Look how nice and bright the colors are. Um, that's because I used Liquitex pouring medium. Um, when it dries, it looks like it's still wet. It just looks so pretty. Alright, so I'm really happy with how this turned out. I think it looks amazing. Hey everybody, I couldn't forget to show you the project I was working on that I talked about in the beginning of the video. Um, I had poured on this piece of glass and I waited for that to dry and I put a couple light coats of the Winsor & Newton gloss varnish and then I took a stencil and I used um, paint markers and I just made the words on there and then I put one more light coat of the Winsor & Newton gloss varnish and the frame itself was brown. I didn't really like it. It didn't go with um, the, the colors. So I painted several coats of white on it. Sides, I got it on the back too. And, um, and then I sealed it with the Liquitex um, matte varnish. I didn't want it to be shiny because I didn't want, I mean, it's, it's you know, has a little bit, um, but not much. I didn't want it to take away from from the painting itself. So anyway, it's all done. It looks really, really good, and um, it's a gift for someone. So I'm happy with it. Hopefully she will like it as well. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like this video. And I'm getting close to a 1,000 subscribers, so if you guys could subscribe, that would be awesome. Okay, thank you. Have a great day.